but 55 to the foot. You should be the one who's most confident in what you're doing. I have autistic tendencies. No, you can pull the flush like everybody else. Hello, you certified kosher piece of cantaloupe. Oh, on um, second thoughts, kosher is a Jewish thing, isn't it? And if it is, that's probably not, it's not probably what I should be saying at this time, is it? No. Tell you what though, it's Friday. Honestly, Friday has no bearing on whether I get cold pressed juice or not, but we're gonna go and get cold pressed juice. But, oh man, am I, <laughs> yay. <laughs> Today uh, is, is good, okay. I'm sorry, let me demist, I can't, I don't, I th have we established now that I am horrific at multitasking? Okay, good. Well, editing a video this morning, I went onto YouTube to reply to a couple of comments, literally a couple, like two comments. <laughs> and I found a YouTube video from Jay Alto, who is what you would call a, I would call him a certified guru in the YouTube world. And his video was essentially just saying, YouTube is changing. YouTube is moving from a place of this highly edited retention content to set the camera up and whatever happens, happens. As little work edits, as little as possible. And do you know, I don't very often doubt myself in my abilities and what I'm trying to do. And I really, really don't mean that from a uh, arrogant perspective or being obnoxious. I just believe that if you're gonna do something, you should be the one who's most confident in what you're doing. Even if you're not sure if it's gonna be work out, you be confident at what you're doing. Because what's the point in doing it if not? If like you have this idea, Wes, it might not work out, so I won't go, I won't go all in. I'm not talking about spending 100% of your time, I'm talking about the confidence in moving into it. If you don't feel that way, there is no point. So to hear him sharing his thoughts on this, it's just like, I mean, this guy works with Mr. Beast, Ryan Trahan, Airac, all of the top YouTubers. But that was nice to hear. And one of the videos is actually weirdly doing quite well this morning. So the video we posted yesterday, for the first like six hours or so, maybe even more, it didn't get anything. And now in the last hour, <laughs> it's crazy views, all right, ready? It's gone up by about 15 or 20 views. Which means it's, and from the analytics, shows that it's being recommended to people, which is great. But, Hearing Jay Alto this morning has also put me in a very strange position because we want to keep minimal editing on the video, right? Like that's set. I really, truly believe that's, that's a good thing. But the thumbnail, I'm stuck on whether I make it a creative looking thumbnail so it's appealing to click on or if I just use a screen grab from the video. Now, why is this so tough? Number one, it's so easy to just pull a screen grab from the video, okay? Like, that's just, it's the easiest thing to do. But I enjoy making the thumbnails. At times. Sometimes it's kind of a chore, but then once I get into it, the kind of creative juices start leaking. That is absolutely horrific. Oh. You know, in my head, I'm thinking, oh, I wish you didn't have to hear that. And I could very easily stop you from hearing that. I could just cut it out, but I'm not. I'm gonna make you hear that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I guess I'm not really sorry, am I? No, I'm not. So that was really nice to hear. What else was there? I have this new folder on in TikTok where I'm saving videos that are gonna be like topics to talk about in here. Now I really, well have a look at my screen time when I get home. 
or when I get here to the gas station. And I really don't think I spend much time on TikTok. I spend the majority of my time on TikTok looking through the notifications and replying to comments versus watching content. Because when you're, maybe if, you, if you're a creator too, you might think the same way. But to me, when I'm watching TikTok or when I'm watching videos, I'm not watching it for just enjoyment. I'm watching it for research purposes, which means I'm better than you, right? I am a better person because I don't waste my time on TikTok like you. No, I waste, I waste more than enough time on TikTok. Let's be clear about that. But I spend it like doing what I would call research. It's, to me, that's no different than someone who owns a construction company looking at how other companies are doing their work or how other businesses are doing their work and finding ways to improve what they do. All right, please see me, please see me, please see me. You have, thank you. All right, let's go, let's go get some juice. Hopefully I won't offer them to try my juice this time. Okay. Put you in there. There, there, there. Put my window up. Park and go. Oh, windy, it's a bit windy. Me, I don't want people to feel weird, so I'm gonna cover the screen. Sorry. It's <laughs> welcome. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. Morning. Hey. All right, the lady working is the lady that I offered. Oh no, what a joke. They have the two flavors that I normally get, are gone. Pineapple, uh, uh, let's try it. One of each, yeah. Honestly, I'm not, I'm not drunk at 7.40. Hi. How I'm are just, you? I am well, thank you very much. How are you doing? I'm good. Good. Thank you. Casey's reward? Uh, no. 588. Did you want a bag? No, I'm okay. Thank you very much. Any fun plans for your weekend? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think too much. But remember we talked last time. Have you tried one of these yet? Not yet. You haven't? No. All right. Well, wait till the other flavors come in because okay. these are the only two that left. And they're not Have that great. great day. Thank you. You too. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like I've misinterpreted that small talk as she was actually starting communication. I think she was just being polite. And I'm that weirdo that's made actual conversation. Like I really don't, I don't mean this insensitively to people who are autistic, but I feel like at times I have autistic tendencies. I really don't think I'm actually autistic. So, I, I don't know if sympathy, sympathy is definitely not the right word I'm looking for. I shouldn't, I should just not have said anything, should I? And then when it comes to ADHD, I mean, we've spoken about this a few times, but I don't, don't really know how I truly feel about that. Oh, I was meant to show you something, wasn't I? What was I gonna show you? I'll pull in down here. What was I gonna show you? What was it? 
What was it? Um. It wasn't YouTube, was it? It wasn't the TikTok folder. I'm sorry. I'll watch this back when I get home and then we'll find it. And I'll, I'll show it you. You see, I have the brain memory, well, just memory because it's not like your feet remember anything, is it? I have the memory of a sieve or like a colander. Got lots of holes in it. I just, I felt like I had to add that bit in there in case, in case we didn't get it. We used to, that was a dad joke that my dad would throw on us. But we've got, and I've got another one as well, which is, which is absolutely, it's just, it's nice, you know? It is, my mum did a lot of baking growing up. And so my sister and I would be like, mum, mum, can I lick the bowl? And dad, being a dad, would pipe up in the background, no, you can pull the flush like everybody else. Dad, I'm glad you realized what bowl I was talking about. Do we have any thoughts on TikTok shop? I... The, oh my gosh, dude. The number of emails I've received, I would say over the past, not maybe not even week, the number of emails I've received from Chinese companies that are selling crap on TikTok shop, that are saying, um, we'll give you, I don't know, like 15 or 30% commission for you to make a video on our product. It's, number one, they're annoying because you think you've got a cool opportunity in your inbox but it's not, it's something stupid. And the other thing, I don't want to use my platforms to sell. I want to use my platforms to create entertainment and I'm more than happy to feature products in that entertainment, as part of that entertainment. But I really, really, really don't want to be in a position of trying to sell. Like, who am I? to pitch you something. I don't know, I, I just think the world is changing. Marketing in the world is changing. People don't want to be sold to anymore. They want to be shown a product functioning, working, doing its thing, and then they can choose to buy it if they want to. nice at first then it gets pretty gross and then it's nice again I'm a bit of a worse right like I don't like looking at the ingredients but going back to that previous thought there's one ad that I think might be the best ad I've seen it was from a dude called Italian batch back barch Italian b-a-c-h on tiktok He's English, he does like comedy skits. I think, I think he's really funny, actually. <laughs> I do like his stuff. And this video was, you know what? I'll find it, just play it in a second. I think it got like organically 8 million views and it was an ad for an Xbox. So good. So, so good. But I think you'll find that so many brands and agencies do not trust in the creative of an ad. A lot of companies still think they have to spew out their specs of a product to get someone to buy it. They think that that's the way to advertise. It's not. Like you imagine if I was selling any of my merch that I have, socks, shorts, t-shirts, hats, bottles, and I told you about the specs of it, about my socks, 33% spandex, 33% cotton, 33% polyester. 
best socks in the world. Ultimate stretchy, they cover your toes. And the whitest of white. You'd be like, ah, no. I don't want those stupid socks. I mean, all right, you're lost, you're lost. They're the best socks in the world, but you know. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in a video the other day too, but um, it's the really, it's the small things, I think in a video that uh, can absolutely kill it and make it feel like someone's being sold to. So the uh, some anchor videos I did recently, the product is a, it's essentially a portable charger for the iPhone 15. So it's USB-C and charges it super fast. Now I think the name for it is USB-C Nano Power Bank. None of that sounds appealing. What people, no one wants to hear that, right? Like they're okay with hearing that it's a fast charger for the iPhone 15, or that it charges quickly. I don't care about the flipping name of it. People can search for whatever they want these days. They'll just search Anchor, iPhone 15, portable charger or just go on Anchor's website and it'll be there. We need to stop forcing the product on people and the features on people and let people make the decisions, give them the real buying power. And I understand for a business that's hard to accept because you think, yeah, I'm putting all this money into marketing and you're telling me I'm, I might not get sales from it? You're telling me we're not gonna try and drive sales? Like, oh my gosh. Like, no, it's not about that. It's about exposure for your brand. It's about getting, allowing the viewer to see how the products can be used and how they can link it in with their own life. Okay, boy. Let's um, the dude who's been doing the automation, by the way, for the social media clips, has been sick. He's he said he was hoping to get it finished by today. So I think I'll check in with him, see where he is. He's been pretty good at communication, actually. All right, let me stop this, and then I'll I'll watch this. What you're about to see is the um, whatever I was talking about earlier. <laughs> All right, I just watched the video back. Looks like it was screen time I was gonna be showing you. So, um, settings. Screen time. So my daily average, oh, let me just screen record right now. All right, so daily average is four hours and nine minutes, down 11% from last week, that's good. Then let's look. Uh, See all activity. TikTok. Oh, that's today, 33 minutes. <laughs> that's right, because I watch when I'm at the gym. So, TikTok, my daily average is two hours and five minutes. So I'd say, I sit in the car when I get to the gym. I sit in the car for maybe like 10 minutes before I go in and then maybe like 12 to 20 minutes while I do cardio at the gym, I'll watch. And then the rest of that, yeah. Because I don't really touch my phone from, stop this, uh, like four o'clock through till eight, once Rookie goes down. Don't touch it. And that, honestly, that's actually really nice. I like that. But as I know it's annoying. Yeah? Oh, look at that. My chef has breakfast ready. Okay. I'll be right back. And then uh, I need to pull some video off of my PlayStation, which no idea how. So let's go and figure that out. This might be the best part of my day. Shay! Shay! 
Rookie, the trash man is here. Rookie, quick. Rookie, quick. Where are they, Duda? Rookie. You got him? Okay. Oh, nice. All right, you can jump in. I'll make sure I don't catch you in the background. Do you want to look, Rugies? Oh, you want to look out the window for the trash truck? Wait, it left. Oh, it's reversing. Do you see it? Oh, might have to blur the bottom bit of that. Oh, Rugie, look, it's reversing. Whoa, Rugies. What's this? What's this? Oh, wow. Dude. Oh, the grabber's coming out. Whoa. Oh, dude, wasn't that good? Can you clap? Good job. Wow. Okay, do you want to say bye-bye? Good job. All right, yeah. All right, do you want to jump back in the shower with mummy? Go on then. Ah. Yeah, run back in the shower. It's cold, isn't it? All right, one second. Here's a little life hack for you guys with girlfriends or wives or whatever, or she males or something, I don't know. When they're showering, especially in these coming winter months, stick the towels in the dryer for like a couple of minutes and then bundle it all up or fold it very nicely. Just put it next to the shower. Don't tell her, don't tell her. Just be like, boom, I'll take care of you. I'll take care of you. Yeah, do that, they'll like it. Trust me. And if she doesn't like it, she's not the one, she's a hoe. I don't make the rules here. Yes. I am currently looking up how to export video from PS4. All right, share screenshots from video clips. How to transfer PS4 to your phone. Let's try 2023. The fact that I'm Googling this is terrible. That's, that's boomer type stuff right here. I actually just spent like 30 minutes on the phone with my dad teaching him how to do something. Um, upload a video clip, viewing clips that you saved, saving a video clip. That wasn't helpful. Okay, let's go to... Uh, what options do we have? I imagine settings. Storage. Nope. Oh, gosh. Powerful. There's a place. PlayStation. Oh, my videos. Don't need you anymore. Oh, you're recently. What? What? Oh, you're recently watched newly added. Okay, so I guess that's not the right spot. Oh, capture gallery. All. This is the one. Options. Copy to USB. I had a USB yesterday, didn't I? What do I do here? I need a USB to USB-C. At a time like this, I need, oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh.
I remember this USB stick was like four gig. I have no idea when this was from. But the fact that four gig at the time was actually quite a lot. Do you remember when we had MP3 players? They were like, you know, I guess like this size. And a one gig or a four gig was like a thousand songs or four thousand zong songs. And that was like crazy. What do you mean the USB storage device is not connected? I just plugged it in, you mogul. I have to format it or something. Things like this that in my mind should be very easy. Like it's not even being recognized as a device. Oh man. I guess I'm going to put it onto this hard drive. Makes me want to just play. USB storage device's file system is unsupported. That's great news, isn't it? Dude, why is why is life so difficult sometimes? I need There's a cape. Oh my goodness. Uh, you will do. You will do, young sir. Don't tell me I'm going to have to format a hard drive in the right way just to get one video file off of here. What do you mean it's not connected, mate? This is something that really frustrates me, is something that should be so easy is not. So I guess I need to format this a different way. Okay, extreme SSD is the one that I am going to erase, and I guess I'll do it in a, I don't know what format to do it in, but we'll see if that works. My, my greatest fear, greatest fear, is that I go to format one of my hard drives, which if you're not sure, removes everything, kills everything. My greatest fear is that I do that on one of the drives that I'm currently working off of with all my footage. And I hope to never do that. I would, I would normally and I should disconnect all the other drives that I'm not using so that there's no chance of that happening. Bro, what do you mean there's no device connected? Do I have to do something to get a storage device connected? I don't know. I'm going to use... 
Oh, what did I want to do with ChatGPT this morning? Something. I was kind of excited to use ChatGPT. Was it to get ideas for this real estate video that I was talking about yesterday? I feel like it was. Oh, maybe the problem is the data cable, because it's not even reading anything to my laptop. So you can bugger off. And then I will use you. Unplug you. Get you into here. You into here, the longest USB cable in the world. Copy to USB device, not connected. Okay, that's good. So at least it's detected it and it's saying it's not supported. So format it a different way. Extreme SSD, nothing there, erase. I, I cut a load of that out because that was boring. It was, it's just me struggling to get something done, really. USB storage devices file system is unsupported. Why is this so difficult? So do that good girl. All right, that's my that's my last option on here. Otherwise, I'm going to have to do something else. And I'm not quite sure what. I actually might have to upload this to a YouTube channel, download it and then delete it. Oh, sweet. Copy. Oh, okay, good. We got it done. That was a pain in the ass. I, um, I didn't get very much of this this morning. That was ruggy. I just cleaned my teeth, so I guess I'll be waiting for a little bit. You know something as an adult now I've realized? <laughs> that uh, this ingredients, organic tart, organic tart cherry juice, organic beet juice, organic strawberry puree, organic apple puree, organic pear puree, 
organic lemon juice. That is, that's all the ingredients. As little as I know, so no sugar added, not from concentrate, no preservative added, no preservatives added. I would say that's good. I would say that's very good. But it's funny, that's still 35 grams of sugar in this. I know it's, you would call it what, like good sugars? But still, it's a lot of sugar. Okay, we have that off. Get you over here. All right, for the thumbnails, I know we've gone back and forth on what to do. And I'm, I can't make up my mind if I should be uh, doing a nice, oh yeah, I guess we kind of talked about it already, didn't we? Kind of forgetting everything. But for this video, we have the, the needle mat template of a thumbnail. But I think, I'm not sure how to do the numbing thing. I might just get a shot of me covered in the saran wrap or whatever you call it. That might be it. I don't know, I will let me get this hard drive out and sorted. There's nothing on you, so you need to go charge. Oh dear. You can go away. Once you're done, I can put you away. Sorry, Duda. Let's look at the Daily Planner. Having a carpet in your office is a terrible idea. Especially when you have a chair with wheels. With wheels. Right. You can go, you can go. Goody. All right, let me uh, start this upload and then we'll get into tweak the thumbnail. You know, before we do that, we'll check out the. All right, screenshot, nice, that was a good one. I need to, up I think I, <laughs> I need to update this planner, delete screenshot. Uh, all right, first edit the YouTube, so let's go on. Good stuff, all right. So edit YouTube. The thumbnail is next and then plan the real, real estate video. So what time is it? It's, geez, 10 o'clock. Well, slightly behind schedule because in eight minutes we should be planning the real estate video. So let's get going. Isn't it amazing how things come up and take, all, take away your time? I don't need you. All right, see you in a second. All right, video's exporting, but I was just looking through some of the other clips I have on PlayStation here. Just, just look at this. Uh, it's so bad, I'll play it. All right, so running up, I'm just trying to time it, so running up the steps now. This is five to foot. Actually, the aim is just. What was that? What was the aim for there? Mate, 
back to the lobby. See you later. You just don't, you can't teach that kind of gameplay, can you? It's just unreal. Like I look at that and then I look at how I play now and I think it's so different and I think I'm so much better now, but I'm still so bad. All right, okay. All right, we've got the screen recording. The video is currently uploading. I actually really like this as a thumbnail. See you, Rooks! Hang on. <laughs> I lost them. They left the, they left the house. They flipping left. <sighs> My child doesn't love me. All right, get you a bit closer, you sausage. Ooh. Lila! Come here, Lila! Okay. Hello, Lila. No, relax, please, Lila. Lila, please, relax. Chill out. Come here. Good girl. All right. Yes, yeah, so like this was the original style of thumbnail that I went for for the needle mat series it's done all right not that great but i feel like where is it this one is more imposing i'd like to get a shot that's similar to this but more with the like showing the saran wrap around my chest so i think or maybe a shot with my wife rubbing it in I really have to go one way or the other, and at the moment it's just the indecisiveness that is killing me. Hello, Lila. What's up? Hello. Hi, Duda. Kind of like that shot. It's one. What is it? What do you need? Do you need to go out? <laughs> it's just distraction after distraction after distraction. All right, let's go. Let's go. I'm sorry if these videos feel disjointed. That is my life. <laughs> okay. We're going bit by bit. Like, how do I show that I am in this? in terms of in the surround, oh, sorry, I wasn't recording the screen, now we are. Do I can't find the right one. Posture. How is my focus going to be on this? Lila, what are you, whatever that is, what is that? Can you sit down? Sit down or I will muzzle you. Or just put you down. <gasps> no, sit down, Lila. Good girl, Tudor. Why do I not have a shot with me like wrapped in this?
How frustrating. I like that. I, let's just go with the shot of me bending down, looking at the screen. Like, if I had an idea for a thumbnail that I think would be super clickable, it would be me covered head to toe in saran wrap. Maybe that one. All right, let's see what that looks like. Okay, I kind of like that positioning. Let's do it over here as well. You can't really tell that I'm being wrapped though, can you? Like there you can. I feel like because I film a lot of this in this room, Lila, stop. You're not going out again. That's enough. No more with your silly little underbite. Dude, that is horrendously cute. Yeah, that's, that's too cute, Duda. I love you. Lila, you're a pain in the buttock. <laughs> All right, get down. Get down. I love you both. I love you. But I have to do this. Duda, come lie down underneath. I kind of like this shot here. Body's all shiny. Yeah, I, 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 I feel like that is actually a really good one. Okay. All right, so we've got three there. One, two. Where's the shot of me leaning into the camera? I also really like that one. So that is after I have been wrapped up. Phone is in the middle of the table. Oh gosh, why is this so difficult? At what point? Oh, it might be somewhere over here. This J Alto video, by the way, that I kind of mentioned earlier, did, did I? I think I did mention it. Essentially, he's. If I didn't mention this bit, he trains the likes of Mr. Beast, Arak, Ryan Trahan, etc. The big, the big names, and so he has his finger on the pulse and sees where things are going. That's kind of his job, really. And him saying that he sees the new movement of people wanting to relax with YouTube instead of wanting to be mesmerized with a video. I think that is, like seeing that this morning was just like a massive, you're on the right track, Oliver. Here it is. Do I look up at the camera? Just look at this. What do you want, Lila? <laughs> Will you sh shut? There's literally a coyote. 
that's actually a coyote in the car. Stop! Ryder, what the hell? Stop, that's enough. I should have brought a camera. Okay, that's enough. No more. Stop. Duda, that's enough. No more. Lila, that's enough from you as well. Duda! Come here now. Get in here. Go. No. I'm not kidding. That was actually a coyote running across our, across our back garden. Dude, if you, if you were out there with that, um, you would, you'd probably run away for sure. Okay, I think, are you trying to look for it out there? It's no wonder why I make a plan and I can't get anything bloody done, is it? That's enough. No more. Enough. Why don't I look at the camera here? Maybe I don't need to, I just... I think this is enough of an image because it kind of looks like I'm pressing... Let's do that one. Screw it, pal. Kind of like the red of the shorts. So let's um, sh color mask the, the shorts and my lips as well. Lovely. Stop. That's enough. No more. You too, Duda. No more. That's enough. That wasn't as firm as I could be, but I feel like being, you do need to be firm with those. I'm not talking about hitting or smacking or anything like that. I'm literally just talking about letting them know who is the boss and I'm doing a really good job of it. And then you get this annoying flipping, like breath type of bark. That's enough, Duda. <laughs> Honestly, I might, I might cut out all of that section. just because it's annoying for you to have to watch. Or is it annoying? All right. Okay, let's... Oh, I have one clip in here that I wanted to put on my story. It's me gaming and friggin' absolutely killing it. Look at this play. Dude had no idea. Bro got clocked from every angle. <laughs> that should go down in history as my number one play. Just because that's probably my only kill. Dude, I chill out. Let's get this slightly bigger. Okay, then I think.
I don't know where my head's at. Like what I was just thinking about was thumbnails. What do I do? I'm still not sure. I, th I think I should, I should. With where I'm going, I think I should just go for a screen grab from the video. I don't think I should be editing. I kind of, I kind of want to edit. Maybe, maybe if things pick up, I can start to, like we can start to understand that actually the thumbnails, I kind of enjoy making that kind of image and it's not necessarily about trying to get more clicks. I just enjoy that process, which I do. All right, let's get this sorted out on YouTube, get that up to TikTok. And then next, let's plan out this real estate video and get ChatGPT to get some ideas. Let's do it. All right, bye. Can I, can I have that, Miss Rookie? It's got the mic. You give me that microphone. Yeah, I'm, I'm using it. Do you want to, do you want me to carry you downstairs? You want to come with me? Yeah. Okay. Good boy. Okay. Get that microphone over there. All right. I think I'm going to call this video a day. And then tonight and tomorrow, I think the missus and I are going to think through a good idea for what that laundry loom should look like, what we should do for it. And then I guess maybe Sunday we'll do it. I don't know, might be, might be some small vlogs over the weekend. Um, see what we can make out of it. What do you think of that, Rooks? Should we try that? Oh, it's gonna be bloody difficult with a baby, ah. with a toddler. Yeah, do you wanna say bye-bye? You say bye? No? Yeah, that, you're a bit weird, you say. All right. Uh, see you in the next video. Lion.